Hi, how are you doing? Happy to have you here and welcome back to my channel. Today I am bringing to you Nebula Tripod Stand Unboxing and Review. In this video, I will explain the different parts of this product, the setting up, downsides, what I like about this product and more. Please don't forget that the break line below this video are the timestamps to navigate to the topic of your interest in case the video seems too long for you, but I think you will enjoy it as a whole. Please watch all. Thank you for your support. Let's get right into it. I'm in love with this product. You can tell, can't you? They got me spending. This is what essential product topped with irresistible packaging does to you. Anka, Una, well done. Anyways, this tripod stand arrives just like this with no chair over nylon. So let's start exploring it. You see, it's well packaged in this beautiful carrier bag. You can actually carry it anywhere. It's so beautiful. If you've been following me on this Nebula unboxing things, then you will totally understand my love affection with this product. Here we have the tripod stand, the manual, and the inner. Right, okay, so here is the tripod stand. And here is Allen key for maybe unscrewing anything that is supposed to be unscrewed. And here comes the manual. So this is the screw head where you put on the projector and then this is the twist lock. This one is the ball head. The reason why it's called the ball head is because it helps you to project the capsule in whichever way you want to because it rotates, see it goes round so you can actually project it anywhere. And this, and this is the ball head twist lock which you can use to secure the ball head in place after you have adjusted it to your preferred position. So when you place it to the right place you want it to be then you twist the lock and it holds it in place that's what the ball head twist works and then this is the extension column what it does is when I unscrew it and then I can I can extend it however I like it when you do it you just lock it in if you lock it in it stays this way when you want to move it around you open it again and dismantle it this is actually the highest length it can go this is the shortest length See, it's not really that long. We have the the main base, which is here, yeah. yeah. And then we have the the base lock. Here is the base lock. So it's tight. I'm supposed to. Okay, let's see. Mm -hmm. This is the base lock, so you can and move this anyhow you want so in case you want it long, longer and still move it like that and then lock it right so but i'm gonna put it shorter okay and lock it here the final one is the tripod see this is the final one the tripod which you can open and adjust as you like there we go and then it stands wherever you want it this is the tripod i'll bring it short and then i'll try to fix the capsule on it for your information, I have the link to all these products down in the description section. If you are interested, please support your girl's channel and use my link at no additional cost to you. This capsule is really heavy, so be careful so it doesn't fall off your hand. It's on, so I have to switch it up. I have screwed it in. But you see, it's moving. 
the projector to anywhere I want it. Now I want it to be straight. I'm gonna tighten this one to make it steady. In one place. So there we have it. Stand one place, it doesn't move. If I want to make it move, I'll loosen it a bit and it will go like this. And if I wanted to project at the ceiling, all I do is I leave it this way and I screw it this way. And it stays for me like this. See? It stays for me like this and I can project at the ceiling. See what I mean? So you can actually move it anywhere you want. And that's the beauty of this tripod. So I'm gonna place it back straight. See? and there we go one downside i have about this tripod stand is it's not long enough for me to project it at the exact position where i wanted it to be so i bought this solar light to help boost the length basically the light is to support the length of this tripod and add beauty because of the ambient changing mood lights it displays Click the card above to see the unboxing and review of this solar light if you haven't seen it. This is how I support the tripod stand with chair and pillow to get the exact projection I want at the place of my choice before I decided to buy the solar light. What I like most about this product is the uniqueness of the bald head concept and the quality of the tripod itself. This is the final look and how it projects just exactly where I want it to be. It is a perfect view, don't you think so? Look at it, perfect view, comfortable at eye length. If I want to make it bigger like a cinema, I will project it on the table, you see here. Like I showed you previously when I reviewed the capsule itself, click the card above to view it. Guys, I mean, I love everything about this choice and setup. And this is it for this unboxing and review. Please smash the like button if you like my review and also don't forget to push this notification button and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so. This will help get my video out there for many other viewers. Thank you for watching. See you next time. Bye bye.